nordhair.com where you get the best hair systems. If you're wondering, am I wearing a hat? Am I about to cut a nice, beautiful bowl cut? No, I'm gonna show you how to properly measure for your hair system so you can manage this at home. Firstly, we're gonna to wanna to purchase our system from lordhair.com, but what do we need? Yes, we need measurements. And what do we need when taking measurements? Yes, measuring tape. So a simple way to be able to measure your hair system is to check where you have lost most of your hair um, and where you want the most significant amount of hair to be placed. In my case, I find that I have receding lines here and I wanna make sure that it is fully covered at the front. So I will take my tape and measure from side to side to get the full measurement at the front, which in my case is six inches. Mm. So once you have the frontal hairline done, you are going to bring on the sides here as well to make sure that you are covering any bald spots that you want to cover. So in my case, this is perfectly fine. So width in total is six inches. You want to get the front to the back, which is the length of the system. You're going to take it from where your pre-existing hairline is or where you might be able to see a few finer hairs. We create, create more natural oils and a sweatier forehead, which will help break down the glue and you'll have a flappy mess sooner than you think. So we want to make sure that we adhere it at best to the front of the hairline. So you're going to take that tape right at the front and you're going to bring it to the back. You can get someone to help you to make sure that you're covering any um, ball spots at the back and how far the system needs to go back down the head. So in my case, I can feel where the regrowth was before. I can get my placement at the back of the head. And in my case, it is about eight and a half to nine inches. Okay, so we've done our measurements. We've done our order online. Oh, look what's arrived in the post. My hair system, and you also re receive a dome. Now this dome is very, very, very important when it comes to taking measurements and to make sure that the system fits snugly on your head. You're gonna take your system, you want to place it inside the dome, making sure that it is nice and flat inside there. You can use something to fill the dome on the inside to make sure that you're getting the correct measurements. You're then going to take a permanent marker and draw around the edges of the hair system onto the dome to make sure that you're getting the perfect size. Once that's done, get your little scissors. You're going to cut up around the edges. And look, here's one I made earlier which is gonna fit perfectly on my head. Okay, so you're gonna place that right at the front hairline where you measured it previously and press down nice and tightly. You have to make sure that the dome is fitting snugly on your head from front all the way to the back. You can see that this does actually fit quite well and it covers my temples, not my temples, it covers my receding hairline. So it's gonna be picture perfect when I place my system on. I have my trimmers, my lethal weapon that's gonna shave my head. All right, so we're gonna turn it on and you're literally gonna go around the dome and you're going to create a line before shaving. And this is basically your guide. Okay, now that everything is ready, I've cut in my lines and I've also pressed down so hard that I mark the front of my head, but that's perfect because it'll give me even better placement when I put my system on. Okay, here we go, let's get shaving. Thank you for watching my videos. Don't forget to subscribe, click the links below. And obviously don't forget lordhair.com who sponsored these amazing videos. Now that you know how to measure your head, you are so sorted. Don't forget to check out the rest of my content, like, do everything, make me feel good. But we'll see you all soon, bye.